tie a knot in the ring, I mean, the, in the rope, so that the ring is locked onto the rope. Excellent, excellent. Now just do what I do. Uh, here's, the, here's the miracle. How do you get the ring off the rope without untying the knot or cutting the rope? If you think about it, it can't be done. That's what we're going to do together. Okay, straight. Take the ring from the bottom with your, are you right handed or left handed? Okay, hold, it, hold the rope in your right hand. You take the ring in your left and lift it up and hold it in your right hand. Now take the bottom of the rope, hold that in your right hand, and swing the ring like this. This is called misdirection. Now, with your left hand, take the ring and gently pull it off the rope and show that the ring is off the rope. But don't wait for the audience to catch up. Now, take the ring and put it back in your right hand and then take the rope from the bottom and swing the ring in the opposite direction and then grab it from the front and show that the ring is now back on the rope. Is it back on the rope? Yeah. It is back on the rope. Continue. That's pretty good. That was the uh, that, was, that was a great great for a beginner. <laughs> All right. Here's what you have to do. Yeah. We're going to show them how it was done. Take the uh, ring in your arm like this. Do you have any pockets? All right. Pretend you have a pocket and uh, reach into it and pull out a pair of scissors. All right. Now cut the rope in half <laughs> like that. <laughs> and um, you can put the ring, well, just whatever with the ring. Now untie the knot, that's fine. Now that you have the uh, ropes cut in half, go ahead and untie the knot and show that you cut the rope in exactly uh, half. Actually, this isn't half. If it's not exactly half, Shreya, just um, grab the yankee and pull and stretch it so that now the two ropes are exactly the same length. You got that? All right. Now we'll uh, now take the, the uh, rope from the bottom and then fuse the ropes back together like this and show that you have one long rope. Do you have one long rope? You have two. Now let's bring this trick to a successful conclusion. Uh, take the take the ends and put them in your pocket or, or pretend to put them in your pocket. Just put them down down there and hold on to them and then just snap your finger and make the ends travel up one. That's two ends right here. The middle is in your pocket. And the middle is in your pocket, kind of. Ladies and gentlemen, try everybody. Perfect. You did perfect.